so what you saw just in the demonstration is what's known as creating your own healing vortex. So it's usually recommended that if you do have like a nice backyard uh, that you can uh, utilize, then you can transform part of that backyard into your own vortex. Now you can also do this indoors as long as you have the space. But basically what you saw me do was just uh, place down my anchor, which is basically anything that you wish, whether it be uh, you know a, a drawing, an image, a crystal, a gemstone, whatever you feel represents a very high resonance in vibration. So basically you're placing that down as the nexus point. That's your nexus. Once that's done, you start walking forward. One, two, three. Three big steps. What you can also do additionally is if you want to map out the four directions. So you take three big giant steps forward, which would be your north. You would place down, say, a gemstone there. You would walk three big steps back into the nexus. And then you would go left, walking three big steps, placing down another gemstone, for example, walking back to the nexus, walking backwards, you know, not really actually walking backwards, but turning around and walking in the other direction, three giant steps, placing down another gemstone, coming back to the nexus, then of course, going to the right, three big steps, another gemstone. So you're mapping out your four directions. This can help perfect your direction in regards to creating your circle, your vortex. Once that's done, you come back to your nexus point and you start walking ahead three giant steps again, back to your northerly direction. And then you just start, you know, using your, putting your hands together in namaste position. And you just start creating a keyword through each step that you take. Through my own example of what you saw me do, pertaining to the vortex, with each step I use the following rhythm. Love, healing, rejuvenation, restoration. Love, healing, rejuvenation, restoration. Each step that I took, I announced this keyword within my mind. Love, healing, rejuvenation, restoration. Now you can always create your own type of keyword, but it's really good just to keep it to one word because it follows the rhythm of your path as you're walking this alchemical circle. Once that's done, you create the circle, walking in full circumference for a total of 10 times. Once you come to the 10th uh, point of the circle, you're starting at the northern position. You're basically just taking your hand out and you're just holding it here. And you're just allowing some type of sign, some type of image, some type of sensation to come through to give you a confirmation that this vortex has been successfully created. With my example, when I was uh, at my 10th position, I held my hand out and basically what I saw was the Merkaba vessel and I also felt a counterclockwise spinning. I literally felt the entire land shifting and spinning counterclockwise. That was my own personal confirmation that the vortex has been created. Now the vortex is permanent, so it does not leave. So you're basically creating the energy here through your alchemical circle. Even if people start to go inside of it, it's okay. It's a permanent vortex. All right. The only time that it could actually be distorted is if there's you know, another person that tries to perform another type of method within it or anything like that. But uh, if you wish, you can definitely safeguard your uh, vortex and you can continue to purify it each and every single day or each and every single week, whatever you like, just coming out and doing the exact same thing. Having your anchor point, having your north, east, south, west anchor points optionally and just starting to do it all over again. And this will help to purify the vortex. But again, you have created a permanent marker in regards to your own space. This is your healing vortex. You then go and sit in the center of the nexus and you just enjoy the energies as they come through. As you've created a gateway, you've opened up a portal, you've opened up an, a nexus, a uh, vortex in regards to rejuvenating your health. So if you're ever feeling that you have a bad headache or your back sore, or you're getting any other types of uh, discrepancies, just go in the center of your vortex and just start repeating that chant that you used when you're creating the circle. Love, healing, rejuvenation, restoration, for my example. All right, so that is creating your vortex. So thank you very much for watching. All the best to you. If you have any questions on this, feel free to drop me an email, info at consciousmatrix.com. Thank you very much. Namaste.